So it's minus 19 outside this morning and the shed is holding at three degrees. I have the idle set a little high maybe. I'll just leave it at that. These hives come in a little bit wet with the snow and I still have these entrances in. So they're still drying out a bit. They look pretty settled for the most part. I'm going to turn the fan up either today or tonight, just or tomorrow morning, just to cool the shed down. And I'm gonna have Carrie take out all these entrances just to help dry the inside out a little bit. It's pretty humid in this room right now. So you can see the vents, the air intake. It's condensed almost like it's January right now. But I can feel the cold air coming in. So that's minus 19 coming in. Cold draft. And it's mixing in with this humid air inside. So it's going to help zap this extra humidity. As you can see, like, everything's a bit wet because it's been sitting in snow and, and a wet fall. So we just have to dry things out. They're extremely wet. So I, I have to take these entrances out because excess humidity, excess moisture in the colonies will not do them any good. I certainly don't like this white light. There's bees everywhere here. They're, like they're filling all the space down there. So I'm quite pleased. I'm going to... So I have to, for sure, to be able to take these entrances out. Carrie's going to get just destroyed in here if I don't cool the shed down. So I'll turn the fans right up, cool it down to minus five or something, whatever it can do. Just to pull the bees back into cluster a little bit and make them less uh, aggravated. These nukes are looking pretty good. Big bunches of bees. These are the ones I picked out of the water. They shall sure have expanded their clusters. I haven't done an assessment yet, just because we've been so busy. I haven't counted my hives. So that's the next job I gotta do. Now, I haven't really done any type of, you know, viability check where I just walk around and find a, try to find blank spots. But for the most part, the only thing I'm not happy about is the condition of my boxes. Look at the moisture in that one. So I gotta get that entrance out. Quite happy with that. Sure is wet. So I got to relieve that moisture issue. I'll just maybe keep the temperature. Well, I'm going to try to maintain that four degree temperature. I'm going to continue with this air exchange. It's going to help. I'm going to maybe increase the speed of these fans just to circulate the air inside here just a little bit more but after I have Carrie remove all these entrances I'm just try to dry these hives out a little bit just to help them dry out and then what I'll do is I'll turn these ceiling fans I'll put them on more of a low just to nicely mix the air and I'll try to send this shed into a state of quiet sleep. Sure feels good to have the bees inside.